B1 English Test GESA Grade 5 Trinity College London For indefinite leave to remain in the UK, permanent settlement, British citizenship naturalization, and permanent residency, self-secure English language tests. Sorry, I got disconnected. Never mind. It's okay. Yeah. All right. So that's, so if you're ready, let's start. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. So the, this is Trinity College London GESE graded examination in spoken English. My name is Angelina. I am your interlocutor for your spoken exam today. What's your full name? My name is Sadaf Zahir. What's your topic's title for today? My topic title is my family. What are your five topic points? My five topic points are traveling with family, eating out with family, cooking for family, shopping with family, and watching TV with family. Now, I'm going to set a timer on the screen and I will talk to you. Rather, I'll ask you questions for five minutes about the topic points that you just told me. Okay. What kind of TV programs do you like to watch with your family? I like to watch uh, TV serials um, uh, and sometimes I like to watch uh, morning shows. Sometimes I wa uh, watch news. <clears throat> okay. Could you tell me about a TV program uh, that you had seen recently? Recently, I watched a uh, drama, uh, Pakistani drama. Uh, it's uh, very nice. So I like it. I watch with my family. Do you <laughs> like to watch films on TV? Yes, I like to watch films on TV. What kinds of films do you like to watch on TV? Uh, it depends on my mood. Sometimes I like to watch uh, comedy. Mostly, mostly I like to watch uh, comedy movies with my families. Okay. And could you share an experience when you traveled with your family? Uh, recently, um, I travel... Uh, Last last month, I traveled in Brefford uh, with my family. It was uh, really nice. I enjoy it, and um, because uh, it's long time, I I'm not going anywhere, so it's it's very very nice, uh, and I lot of time spent with my family, so I really enjoy it. All right. How do you prefer to travel with your family? Mostly, I prefer uh, travel by car. All right. Um, could you share an experience with me when you traveled with your friends? Yeah. Last year, I traveled with my friend. It was really nice experience because uh, uh, my friends uh, are uh, living uh, uh, out of city so if he, uh, she's come and then we are going to uh, in restaurant and it's it's a very nice experience and we enjoy so it's um, uh, so i i really enjoy it all right okay uh how often do you eat out with your family uh, mostly I eat out uh, once a month with my family. What kind of food do you order when you eat out? Uh, mostly I order um, Asian foods because my my husband likes Asian food, so that's why I like. But sometimes I eat English food. Okay. <laughs> So, could you please tell me about a recent experience when you ate out? Recent experience. Uh, la last week, I go to 
in restaurant uh, in Tipu Sultan because my favorite restaurant and I ordered um, for Asian foods means like I order uh, chicken krahi and uh, some rice and uh, I and some I ordered um, uh, shish kebab and um, pasta and and uh, I ordered um, some um, dessert so it was a very nice experience because always uh, in uh, always I go there and it's uh, very uh, like lovely food I like it and uh, I, I enjoyable <clears throat> do you like to eat out on special occasions what occasions are those uh, yes, I like uh, eat out and special. Um, mm -hmm. Last month, I uh, in my husband, uh, my husband's birthday, so I go there uh, um, for eating out mm -hmm. in our f favorite restaurant. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's fine. That's fine. And um, my last question to you is about your favorite shopping center. What's your favorite shopping center and how often do you go there? My favorite shopping center is uh, uh, Bullring. It's uh, it is my near my house, so I like I go there mostly, um, once a month, uh, sometimes uh, one, uh, twice a month. So I I like it. Mostly I I I, um, I buy um, clothes, shoes, and uh, um, sometimes I buy makeups, jewelries. Thank you. This is the end of your discussion and you have passed. Congratulations. Now, we're going to have a conversation with each other. Conversation. Okay. I will give you two topics. The first topic okay. of conversation is clothes you like to wear. Clothes okay. you like to wear. Look, usually there are five important topics. Entertainment, yeah. music, means of transport, personal experiences, festivals, festivals. and special occasions. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to choose the clothes you like to wear because of it's a part of your personal experience. It's, right? Yeah, it's their personal experience. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So, what kind of clothes do you like to wear? Uh, mostly, I like to wear uh, traditional clothes, means kameez and shalwa. Uh, which kind of, uh, which is your favorite clothes to like to wear? Um, well, I really like to wear anything comfortable that is loose and the cloth has to be extremely soft. I think that's yeah. what I prefer. Yeah. It could be anything, Western or Eastern, but it has to be the quality of the cloth. Yeah, yeah it's comfortable. You feel yeah. comfortable. So like, exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, how often do you buy clothes? Sorry? How often do you purchase clothes? How often do you buy clothes? Uh, I buy clothes uh, once a month. Sometimes I recently I buy uh, last week. I buy some shirt for uh, for night, uh, night clothes. I uh, I like it. It's comfortable. It's comfortable for me. <clears throat> Do you think designer clothes are too expensive? Uh, yes, I think so. Designer clothes is, is too much expensive. But I check online uh, if it's a discount, so I, I, then I buy it. What do you think? It's expensive or not? Is I designer too, clothes too, too expensive. Yeah. Because the quality of the cloth might not be as amazing as you might think. You know, yeah, I think, um, yeah, yeah. and I believe that when it comes to traditional Pakistani clothes, I would not say that designer clothes have the best quality cloth. You know, they don't yes. use good quality cloth. That is yes. something that you can do all by yourself. You know, finding the correct kind of material for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Thank you. That is the end of conversation, part one. Now, part two. We're going to talk okay. about a special day in your country. So could you please tell me 
about a special day in your country? In my country, special day is uh, Eid al-Fitr or Eid, uh, Eid and Eid al-Azha is special days. How do you celebrate these days? Mostly I celebrate it a day. Um, I I I I I uh, we we celebrate um I we um, all family members is meet together and spend spend time together and I eat food together and I wear new clothes and um, sometimes I go for uh, outside. Um, means I uh, some sometimes I go for park, so it's nice. Uh, I I like it. How uh, how, how do you celebrate? Uh, um, uh, in a special uh, uh, sorry, how do you celebrate in in a, what's topic? Sorry, I can. Uh, Remind, special day in your me? country. Oh, sorry. How how do you special day in your country? How do you celebrate? I usually um watch documentaries about that day, or maybe hang out with my family mostly. Okay. Can you ask me one more question? Okay, and uh, how? How much? Uh, how many time do you spend? Uh, um, uh, in special days. Mm, how many or how much? How many? Not how much. How many days? How for how many days do I celebrate the special occasion? Yeah, how many days? Probably two or three. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have passed your test. Congratulations to you, Sadam. You don't have to be afraid. Yeah, sometimes because I, if I understand everything, so I do, uh, I answer. If not, so it's, for me, it's, uh, I'm scared. But this is a very easy test, beautiful, nothing yeah. hard. Just understand yeah. the, the questions. Yeah, That's yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know it's, it's so easy, but uh, I feel if I understand, so everything I, so I, I answer, but if not, so. It's fine. Yeah. Okay, go ahead.